Over the break, I got to uh, celebrate my birthday. I didn't want to do anything crazy. I saw that Six Flags had opened up, so I told my wife, I just want to hang out with the kids and, and, just, and just go to Six Flags and just have a good time together as a family. So we did. Now, Kaysen, my son, was totally fine with riding roller coasters. How old is Kaysen again? Kaysen's nine. Okay. But my daughter Chloe had never ridden them because she's always been too short. But now, guess what? She's not too short. Now she's Yay. now she's of now she's of height. Okay. All about them posters now. And although she was too short for a couple of the ones that I wanted her to try, there was one in particular that has two flips. I think it's called Shockwave. Yeah, yep. two flips. Yep. And I did my research, and I and I saw that this would be a good in, introductory uh, roller coaster to a to a little kid because it is it is fast, but not the fastest. But here's what I was not going to do. I wasn't going to tell my daughter that this roller coaster had flips. Oh, she I know, Kelly. Them. Sometimes, and my, my parents did this to me, sometimes you got you to gotta trick the kid to do something so they can realize that it's actually not that bad. Mm. So we got in line, and, yeah. and my daughter was asking, like, what are we riding? And I said, you know, <laughs> just, <laughs> just going to ride a ride. I don't know. Let's just, just, let's just get in this line and see where it takes us. And then we get on the cart, and she's looking around, and I told her that the only ones that flip have the ones that go over your shoulder, right? So, so this roller coaster only has a seatbelt and the one that goes on your lap. So she wasn't thinking anything of it when we sat down and she strapped in. Mm-hmm. But then that's when she looked off. I believe it was to her right. Uh-huh. And she saw the loop de loose And then it starts moving and it takes you up. You know how the roller coasters do. It yeah. takes you up. Yeah. So you start going up and that's when she realized, wait a minute. <laughs> no. We're going to flip. <laughs> So she looked at me and she goes, are there loops in this? And I said, Chloe, I'm not going to lie to you. (laughs) There are flips on this. And she started crying. The girls in front of us, these teenage girls were right in front of us. And Chloe's going, get me off. And I'm like, no, Chloe, it's too late. And the girls in front of us were so nice. They all turned around and they were like, it's okay. We've done this 20 times. They're trying to calm her down. Chloe is screaming, crying. She goes, why are we doing this? No, crying, crying. We get up. The roller coaster releases us. She is crying. Tears are flying. They're hitting me in the face. Oh, no. We do. And the loops are right away, by the way. You go and the loops are happening. Boom and boom. And as soon as we finish the first two loops, and this is where I know I made the best choice to trick her. As soon as we finish the loops, she goes from crying hysterically to screaming laughing. Oh, good, good, good. So I don't know if I'm raising like a maniacal daughter or something, (laughs) but she went from screaming to laughing. And then when we got done, I was like, see, it wasn't that bad. And she looked at me, she goes, I am never, ever, ever, ever doing that with you again. But she wrote yeah. it. But she, she wrote, wrote it. And, and she, she realized laughed. it wasn't too bad. And she laughed. And she laughed. So that's Maybe a lapse in judgment as a parent? Mm. Maybe. Did anybody get hurt? No. If no. She, if she ever has trust issues and it's like, what happened? Well, well when I was a kid. Dad, I know. I thought about that, Anna. I'm like, man, see, you, you do the, these things are trial, trial and error with, uh, with parenting. You, right, just, you right. just do things and you hope nothing bad happens. And I thought I was going to teach her a good lesson. And she enjoyed it.